Right, just wanted to share something with you. Um, I bought some Hobby King Pro Drive uh, 2830s, I think these are. If you can see it. There you go. Hobby King 2830 1100kV motors. Um, just for a test, I plugged them onto these DJI arms um, receiver. Um, yes, yeah, see. Anyway, listen. Now this is one of the good ones. And you're going full. And the vibration is unreal. I mean if you could feel that through there, it's so They are the worst. I actually bought six of them. And that one is the best one. Believe me, it's the best one. Right, as you saw with the, the total bloody mess that I had with those um, Hobby King... I can't remember what motors they were. Um, I've upgraded these to... Tiger MT 2216s, 900kV motors. Um, so I've got four of them on there. Um, I've also got uh, Easy UHF diversity on the back and in the middle I've actually put an Eagle Tree Vector so hopefully I'll get better flight performance um, with the GPS on the top the reason why I've gone for the Vector is Number one is the OSD is a lot better, and also with the naze, I was um, it kept resetting the home point every time it, it every time it lost GPS and got a GPS log again. It was resetting the home point, um, and I want to do this as a as a long range machine. I mean these motors are so smooth in comparison. Well, in comparison to anything really. So I've now got a long range um, quad, flight time, I don't know, 12, hopefully 15 minutes. Oh, and I've got these Gemfan um, carbon reinforced props which are very, very badly out of balance. So they, they took a lot of balancing. So there you go. Back in action again.